This is the High Density Spalier Gardener, and this is an update on my Frederick Passion Fruit vines. I have three vines here growing. The picture shows that they get kind of purplish. They do get kind of purplish, but uh, not a whole lot. Anyway, the, the vines were really growing crazy. I had to go in and prune them back. Um, but I decided I wasn't going to just toss the cuttings. They're growing quite nicely on the um, fence here. Anyway, I decided to save the cuttings and I'm going to root them and start more. Oh, actually, let me, before I go over there, let me show you. I've done that already with a couple of them down here and there. And I have a whole bunch more that I'm going to go through and, and root and then I'll plant them along the, um, the fence. I guess, um, we had about a dozen fruit and I have to say I really love passion fruit. Yep. Put those in this one. You can see. All of these cuttings are really pretty. I have probably, I don't know, a good 20 or maybe even 30 of them. But I'm going to uh, put them with rooting powder inside of a potting mix and see how many I can get. And then to finish the passion fruit video off, just wanted to show I got a different kind of passion fruit. It's not a Frederick, um, but I have no clue what it is. This one really was kind of purple. And I saved the seeds and I planted, um, what, 72 of them to see if I could get any. And it looks like so far I've got one, two, three, five, six, um, about half a dozen coming out. Um, if they do survive, I'll make sure to plant them out and then we'll have a couple of varieties. I have no clue what the name of this one is though. Anyway, if you have any comments or questions, please post them and I will respond as soon as I can. Thank you for watching.